Rates to go up, bad news. Unexpected, unexpected. But uh, numbers released today are suggesting that it is inevitable and quite possible that there will be two more rate rises before the end of this year, which is the November and December meeting. I thought that they wouldn't do it. I thought that they wouldn't do it. But those numbers don't look good. And there's a possibility by putting rates up in November and December, they're going to put a spoiler on the party and retailers are going to be not happy, Jan, because that's when they make a lot of their sales, the Christmas shopping period. However, I think uh, our new RBA boss may have no choice because the inflation numbers are not looking good. I think there's been a heap of sellers that have come onto the market July, August, September, October. They've timed their run pretty good. They've received a little bit of a mini boom because the stock levels weren't at the level we expected them. Now there's more stock coming on. Now there's a little bit of a dampener with this. Buyers are obviously going to be happy. Buyers are going to think, oh, yeah, well, okay, uh, it's good for us. We're going to buy uh, cheaper because the rates are going up. But that's the 